Hey, what's up guys, it's Tech Infusion and welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be teaching you how to seamlessly loop your music automatically. And this is going to be a super helpful tip that will save you a ton of time when it comes to post-production, especially if you like to use background music in your videos. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. All right, so when it comes to using background music, you've most likely have a shot of you talking and you just wanna bring in your background music and cover the whole background part of your video. But then you realize that your music is not long enough. So most of you probably cut the track all up and try to copy it over and find a seamless point to match up the audio and add the ending back on. And at the end of the day, after you've cleaned it all up and made it sound decent, you've already spent at least five minutes on it and that just is not the way you need to do it. What you're gonna to wanna to do is select your audio clip in the project window, come up to edit, go down to edit in Adobe Audition and press clip. This will then open up your music track in Adobe Audition. All right, so the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do in Audition is create a multi-track session. Just name this whatever you want. In my case, I'm gonna name it Audio Loop and just press okay. Now grab your audio track and just bring it into the first layer. Now that you have your audio imported, just come down to properties and basically you wanna click on enable remix. This will take about five to 10 seconds, depending on how fast your computer is to render out the whole clip and analyze it to make sure it knows where to cut it. All right, so from here, it's as simple as coming down to target duration. And here you'll see the actual length of the song. Basically, you're just gonna change this to however long you want your music track to be. For me, I'm gonna change it to eight minutes. It takes about one second to fully analyze and loop your track. And when it's done, you'll have your full eight minute loop or however long you set it music track in your multi-track session, which is awesome. On the track, you can see all the cuts Adobe Audition had to make to seamlessly loop your music track. Go ahead and play it back and you can hear how smooth it really is, which is absolutely incredible since a computer is just figuring out how to loop this song to whatever duration you set it to. So once you're done and you're happy with the way it sounds in Adobe Audition, go ahead and just save the multi-track session to a single WAV file and import that back into Premiere and replace the other audio file you had in there. And now you have the perfectly looped music track that's the exact duration you needed. Anyways, guys, that's all for this tutorial. I really hope this video helped you. If it did, please remember to leave a like and don't forget to comment, subscribe, and hit that bell icon so you don't miss my next video. I hope you have a great rest of your day. And until next time, guys, Peace out.